Hello guys, welcome to Culture Media once again. My name is Gulshan Shah. This video is completely dedicated to the branch pediatrics. So if you have your dream branch pediatric, you're going to know that which are all the states where you can get your dream branch. And in those states, uh, what could be the fee structure, right? In this video, we are going to cover for all those students who can get the government seats through All India Quota, DNB seats through uh, obviously through MCC counselling, at the same time NB diploma seats also for pediatrics. Once we are done with this uh, uh, government DNB and diploma seats of pediatrics, then we'll jump into uh, lower fees private colleges and then in higher fees private co colleges and at last we are going to see that, that the scope of the students who are not yet qualified so the students who are waiting for the revised cutoff to come so once the revised cutoff will come and then the students will get, uh, uh, will get qualified for those students what are the scope what are the options what are the uh, what are the uh, what will be the situation to get branch pediatrics. Let's start the video first of all. Let's talk about government colleges. Obviously when we are talking about government colleges or government hospitals in DNB, uh, one important factor that is needed to be keep in consideration is category. So let's check about government colleges and government hospitals in uh, DNB as well as NB diploma according to category wise first. For general category, if you are scoring under 10,000 rank, then you have a good chances of getting pediatrics through All India Quota. Whereas if you have a score, un if you have a uh, rank under 19,000 rank, you have a decent chances of getting pediatrics under DNB seats, right? DNB seats. Whereas if you are targeting NB diploma, then if your score, if your rank is under 30,000 also, then you have a pretty decent chances of getting NB diploma also. This was for the general category. Now come on to the EWS. For EWS, if your rank is under 12,500, you have a good chance of getting pediatrics from all India quota. If your rank is under 14,000 All India rank, then you have a good chances of getting government seats government call or government hospitals in uh, dnb whereas if your rank is under 30000 then you have a good chances of getting government seats government uh, government hospitals in nb diploma also let's come to the obc now for obc if your rank is under 12000 you have a good chance of getting uh, government seat through all india quota if your rank is under 18000 then you have a good chance of getting government seat through the under DNB uh, hospitals and if your rank is under 31,000 then you have a good chances of getting NBE diploma government seats right similarly for SC if your rank is under 30,000 you have a good chance of getting uh, pediatrics through all India quota that is government seat if your rank is under 35,000 then you have a good chance of getting DNB seat DNB government hospitals whereas if your rank is under 60,000 you have a good chance of getting NBE diploma government hospitals for pediatrics similarly for ST if your rank is under 52,000, you have a good chance of getting pediatrics through All India Quota. If your rank is under 65,000, you have a good chance of getting Government Hospitals DNB. And if, you have, if your rank is under 80,000, you have a good chance of getting NBE Diploma Government seats. Now, once we are done, as I told you that once we are done with the government, we will jump into private. Now, if you somehow miss out government seat, or just say you don't want to go for NB diploma or the uh, DNB, but you are missing with the government seat through all India quota. In that case, uh, you you ha you will be having an option of lower private colleges which are available in Andhra Pradesh and Karnataka. The fee structure for Andhra Pradesh is uh, eight lakh sixty four thousand rupees, whereas uh, the fee structure in Karnataka is eleven lakh fifty thousand rupees per annum. So if your rank is under twenty three thousand, you can get lower fee structure private seats in Andhra Pradesh and Karnataka uh, for pediatrics. Similarly, if you 
if your budget is under 12 lakh just say that you don't want to spend for pediatrics uh, more than 15 lakh uh, in that case you have tamil nadu and haryana state with you so you can target tamil nadu and haryana if your budget is under 15 lakh but in that case your rank should be under 30000 if you are targeting tamil nadu whereas your rank should be somewhere under 34,000 if you're uh, looking for Haryana. Similarly, if your budget is under 20 lakh, like if you don't want to spend more than 20 lakh per annum for pediatrics, in that case, you, you should target Telangana state for the counseling where it, uh, where you can get uh, where you can get a seat a pediatric seat in in private colleges in uh, in Telangana under 23 lakh rupees per annum under uh, 20 lakh per annum but your rank should be somewhere under 23 to 25000 uh, all india rank similarly uh, apart from Telangana if you if your uh, if your budget is like 30 lakh per annum you don't want to spend more than 30 lakh per annum then you have multiple states to target uh, like Uttar Pradesh, Uttarakhand, Pondicherry, Bihar, West Bengal these are the states uh, which are offering uh, tuition fees under 30 lakhs per annum but in Uttar Pradesh if your rank is under 55,000 you can comfortably get pediatrics in Uttar Pradesh Uttarakhand if your rank is under 36,000 you can comfortably get pediatrics in Uttarakhand in Pondicherry, if your rank is under 40,000, you can comfortably get in Pondicherry also. In Bihar, if your rank is under 50,000, you can comfortably get Bihar. West Bengal, if your rank is under 30,000, you can easily get West Bengal for pediatrics for fee structure under 30 lakhs per annum. Similarly, uh, if uh, if uh, like similarly for 30 lakh uh, if you are going for 30 lakh to more states are uh, there like Himachal Pradesh and Haryana so Himachal Pradesh having a fee structure of 28 lakh so it is again under 30 lakhs per annum and Haryana having a fee structure of uh, obviously 14.5 lakh per annum so for that range for the Himachal Pradesh if you, uh, if you wanted to take Hima Himachal Pradesh your rank should be somewhere under 35,000 uh, and ha for Haryana it should be under 50,000 Similarly, if your budget is up to 40 lakhs, like you don't want to spend more than 40 lakhs per annum, right? But your rank, rank is not so good. In that case, uh, you should target for Uttar Pradesh and Chhattisgarh. In Uttar Pradesh, you can get pediatrics branch for 40 lakhs per annum, up to 40 lakhs per annum. But your rank should be somewhere under uh, 60,000 uh, All India rank. Whereas, you can get easily get Chhattisgarh also having a fee structure under 40 lakh per annum, uh, like 37 lakh, 33 lakh. Per annum. Uh, there you can get pediatrics easily till 80,000 uh, all India rank. So if your rank is under 80,000, you can get Chhattisgarh uh, uh, for uh, Chhattisgarh uh, uh, private medical college having a fee structure of under 40 lakh per annum. Similarly, if your uh, budget, if your uh, if you don't want to spend more than 55 lakh per annum, just say that if you have a uh, if you have a uh, all India rank, if you have got all India rank up to 80,000 or the below 80,000, like 81,000, 82,000, in that case, uh, you can apply for Rajasthan also uh, for pediatrics. Uh, in Rajasthan, you can get a pediatrics branch under 55 lakh per annum. Now, below that one, below, I mean, below 80, 81,000, uh, to uh, till the students who have not qualified or the students who are waiting for the device cutoff to come and once the device cutoff will come obviously some more students will get qualified so if once the device cutoff will come and the new students will get qualified so for new students for new qualified students uh, they all have if they all have a uh, have a, a dream branch of pediatric they can get it for uh, 70 lakhs per annum in Rajasthan again they have some other options also like in uh, in Karnataka others quota seat and in deemed NRI quota seats so these these uh, uh, these are the uh, kinds of state which should uh, which you should target at the rank which you have got in the year 2022 so this was all about pediatrics uh, you can join our telegram group for in which uh, uh, we are updating about NEET PG 2022. You can check all the recent notification over there. At the same time, if you want to avail paid services for the counseling, you can just give call to our uh, number on the screen. Uh, we uh, we will be uh, we will be just guiding you through all the counseling. Thank you so much.